I just had a call from someone asking, Brian, can you help me find a job? Unfortunately, I can't. She has excellent background, but the market's a little bit soft in her arena in the programming field. Now, for programmers or accountants or anybody else, there comes a time when you just need to have help to get into a company. Let me show you a backdoor way, kind of a cheaty way, to get somebody in an organization to give you a little bit of help. <clears throat> that way is that you simply have to find out who works in the organization and send your resume to somebody who could make a thousand dollars by recommending you. There's a lot of companies. Now that the markets are expanding, things are getting a little bit harder to find the right person who are offering their employees five hundred to a thousand dollars to two or three thousand dollars. If they'll just bring in the resume of a friend or of an acquaintance or somebody they know who can um, do a really good job for their company. Accountants, CPAs, programmers, uh, right now they're seeing a lot of that. Sometimes salespeople also. So what I would do is I would go to LinkedIn, LinkedIn.com, link to Brian Diltz, and then I would say, um, I would look up people who, let's say you're looking for your CPA, who's a tax CPA. I would do a search for people who have tax and CPA, find out their name, find out what company they're working for, and then I'd call up the main receptionist and say, can you put me in contact with so-and-so? Well, this person is a CPA. They are a tax accountant. I would call them up. I'd say, hi, I saw your name on LinkedIn. I was wondering if you know of any openings there that I could submit my resume for. And then when they say, no, we don't know of any, I would say, do you get a bonus if you submit a resume for someone and you get and they get hired? And then when they say, yes, I would say, okay, why don't I send my resume to you and then you can submit it to Human Resources. Does that make sense? And they'll go, yeah, I like money. And they'll submit your resume. And they'll also have an incentive to call HR back and say, did you get that resume? Is this the kind of person you want to hire? And they'll push that little extra push behind it. They may even take it and hand it to the guy who's doing the hiring for that position, which you will potentially not get to if you merely submit your name to, to human resources. So just as a thought, let's go back over that one again. Go to LinkedIn.com. Link to Brian Dills. I link to everybody, except for my competitors. Sometimes I don't. I link to everybody. I've got 1,500 people in my immediate group. I got a million people who are in my, my secondary group and you'll be able to find some people who you may want to call up, ask them if there's some jobs and if they say no, say, can you submit my resume for me? Will you make money at it? What a great way to, to help them out and for them to help you. I'm Brian Diltz. Uh, my company is AGI, Diltz & Associates, www.diltz.us and uh, looking forward to helping you. I also have a great blog at howtoreallygetagreatjob.com. Take care.